use these precious secret verses and see what will happen in your life these verses are very very powerful they works perfectly hello everyone welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by if you are new here for the first time you are so welcome my name is pamela in this channel i share spiritual tips that will help your spiritual life greatly go through my videos you will see lots of them that will help you spiritually bringing you closer to god like teaching you how to pray the right prayer and making things to work powerfully for you if you love spiritual tips go ahead and subscribe turn on the bell so that whenever i upload videos you get notified and come and watch i share messages on this channel as well as spiritual work and you having faith that is going to work even if it's just prayer without your faith it will not work if you do any spiritual work without your faith it will not work so like today is one of the messages that works powerfully if you want things to start working very well for you pray the right prayer and you see things falling in place for you there are three powerful prayers that work effectively. One is protecting prayer, protection prayer, transformation prayer, and the other one is restoration prayer. Protection prayer, transformation prayer, and restoration prayer. These three prayers, if you incorporate it into your prayer life, the right time is also very important. The time you want to pray is also very important. So without wasting time, I'm going to you know cut everything short short so that this video will not be lengthy. So before you do anything, always ask God to forgive your sins anyway you have sinned against him. Okay? Ask God that God should forgive you, clear, pardon your iniquities anyway you have wronged him, knowingly or unknowingly, that he should have mercy upon you. If you want to include prayer and spiritual work, these prayers will also guide you, you know, help you greatly. If you are doing protection spiritual work like all this spiritual work that protests okay yes in case you are new here i always use natural ingredients mm -hmm. that I mostly found in the kitchen to show you how to make use of it spiritually you know the right way so that things will work for you so that it will protect so that it will cleanse out any evil thing in your in your life so that it can also restore a minimum so if you are doing any protecting uh, spiritual work and you want to back it up with prayer this is the right video for you for protection prayer you have to pray like this oh lord god i pray for your protection as i begin this day you cannot do it alone remember you pray for protection as you begin this day you are my hiding place under his ways you can always find refuge protect me from troubles wherever i go that god should protect you even as you want to make use of this spiritual world that god should make it work better without the presence of god and your faith it will not work and to keep evil far far away from you if you pray like this with any spiritual work you will see it working perfectly in case you don't want to do any spiritual work pray this prayer before you go to bed or early morning before you go out before you go out you see things transforming in your life god will always protect you and always know that you are seeking him when you seek him in anything you are doing you will see him doing anything for you. Transformation prayer. So this one is by telling God what you want. You know what you want. You know that thing that is troubling you. You know what you want to say. Tell God your mind. Tell God that thing you are passing through. For God to transform your life for good. For God to, you know, transform you. There must be change in your life. Tell God that there has to be change in your life. That this is not how you want it. Pour out your mind to God. And you see God doing it for you. So in case you want to do favor work, like favor spiritual work, if you are new here, just go through my videos. You will see so many video titles. Okay, for for example, you want prosperity, you want uh, favor work. Say the right prayer. You know, pour out your mind. Tell God that God's presence should be here. You know, you want God's presence as you do this work. That let it be very effective. So the third one is restoration prayer. So, restoration prayer is by recovering your loss, anything that you have lost in the past. It can be marriage, it can be life, you know, maybe you have lost somebody dear to you. It can be marriage, it can be property, it can be something dear to you that you have lost, that which you want to recover. Pour out your mind to God. Tell God that you want to recover this loss. God is able to restore all the things that you have lost back. He can do it. He has been doing it and you are not alone. He can do it for you. Just pour out your mind. Pray the right prayer. So if you want to do any restorative prayer, 
for restoration prayer it's best to do it at midnight pour out your mind this is a time that there is no distraction everywhere is calm you see the presence of god all around remember ask for mercy before doing anything okay any spiritual work anything at all always ask that god should forgive your iniquities so that as you do it god will guide you as you do that so i want to also tell you some prayers powerful prayers that you should always do very simple prayers okay some people know these prayer verses and this is something that is very common and most people ignore it but they are actually very powerful lost prayer matthew 6 verse 9 verse 23 matthew 6 9 start going down to 23 our lost prayer that one that says our father who art in heaven hello be thy name the kingdom come they will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation. Deliver us from all evil. For that is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. This is a very common prayer. Even children, they know how to pray this prayer. But unfortunately, many people, they ignore this and because they feel that it's very simple. But this is one of the prayer that is very powerful and God listens very well. God hears it. At the end of the prayer, you say, Amen. It's done in Jesus' name. It's another very simple one, very powerful one also, is Psalm 23. You all know it. Many people know it, okay? The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. Just read it, Psalm 23, one verse, the last. Meditate with the lines, and you see how powerful they are. I will lift up my eyes to the ears, unto the ears. Where comment my help? My help comment from God, the maker of heaven and earth. Will not allow you to be put to shame. God is the God that neither sleeps nor slumber. Use this. This is a very powerful one for protection as well. Okay, just go through these verses and say these prayers. At the right time is also very important. Many people, they pray and pray and pray. Things are not working for them. You don't need to shout. You don't need to make lots of noise, disturbing people, for, for your prayers to be heard. Remember that God listens, even if it's a silent prayer. It's the heart of human that God needs. That is why you should let go of anything that is evil, anything that is troubling you, so that as you pray, pour out to God, cry unto God, God will hear you. So just say these prayer points and use these three powerful prayers. Protection prayer, transformation prayer, restoration prayer. By the grace of God, things will turn around for you. Everything you desire will work perfectly. If you want to do it with spiritual work, like I said earlier, you can do it and you see it working. You know, just believe that it's going to work with a clean heart. Everything will work perfectly. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Share this video to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I'll see you in my next video.